Steve from Show Homes Online. And we're at Greenacres in Bishop's Cleeve in Tewkesbury, a lovely development by Persimmon Homes. We're here to see the three bedroom Clayton house type. It's a Clayton corner and built in a beautiful contemporary style. Let's go and take a look around. Hello, welcome Hello. to the Clayton. This is Greenacres, phase four by Persimmon yes, Homes. It is. And this house type is a three bedroom Clayton. Yes. Now we've done a review on this development about a year ago. Yes, we have. Um, we did the smaller house. Yeah, a little Hambury, but this is the yes. new phase, and these are very, very striking houses, aren't they? It's it's a fantastic looking street. So this yes, is a big is. three bed. This. I'm sorry, it's a bit dark. They've um, blocked the door out, haven't they? Well, let's get out and have a look around. Yeah, where should we start? In there. A nice hallway, though. Yes. So it's a larger three bed, I think this is. I was going to say, it's popped some lights on. There we go. Oh, quite a big, quite, quite a big WC. That is, isn't it? Isn't it? Ideal standard sanctuary. A little um, radiator there, and the uh, the toilet there. Very nice. A lot of room for a little bit of additional yeah. furniture in there. Something just a little bit different. Let's go into the kitchen dining room. Yeah, we go. So they've got a little dining area here at the front, which overlooks the front of the. Uh, development and then the the kitchen now they've got the beautiful sparkly granite work surfaces so i would assume oh there we go some of the items fitted in this home are not standard so just to be aware of that that uh, you can upgrade depending on your budget speak to the sales negotiator so let's have a look at the beautiful kitchen there. well i'll tell you what i'm going to have a look at this beautiful um, uh, utility first while well, we're in here we might as well so what we've what have we got here in this in this lovely utility room it's nice you've got a room there for a um a washing machine there um you've got another cupboard there so you could probably put another another appliance in there you've got the volume of the stairs just there with the little new post sticking out nice little detail there the boiler here that isn't boxed away but that's not a big deal got a door outside here so you get a garage um i yeah. think you get a single garage with it so um single garage and here we've got we've got um solar panels on the roof as well so you've got that isolator there we've got an alarm and we've got the rcd box as well obviously you'll have to check with the sales on what's actually um within the price but yeah. good you know nice nice little utility it's always nice to have a utility room isn't it somewhere yeah. to to put your laundry and your dog bed and everything else yeah. out of the way. Right, so we've got fridge freezer there on the end. Uh, they've got a one and a half bath sink. Um, you've got your integrated dishwasher. Again, not sure what's included and what isn't. Plenty of iron line cupboards there. Got an electric hob. Can't see the, uh, the make. You've got your extractor pan above and your oven tucked away below. Um, dimensions, 5 metres 62 by 2 metres 86 in here. Very pretty flowers there, I like those. The speaker's in the ceiling. So there is obviously an optional integrated sound, sound system. system. So the Clayton is no, uh, this Clayton house type is known because um, sometimes a Clayton corner, so it's actually yeah. built on a corner. It's slightly configured differently. It is, but yes. you know, it's a big three bed. You get a lot for your money with this. So this lounge. So actually, down here, you've got two rooms and a utility and a, and a WC, haven't you? But yeah. the two big rooms are the kitchen, diner, and the lounge. So the lounge is five meters sixty-two by three meters eleven living room. Yeah. And what it says here is this is the Clayton Type 1 gable window. So there is the window on the side here. Yeah. And obviously that's a, or that is a bay, a little bay in that window, yeah, isn't it? pushed out slightly. So you will see variations of yeah. this in other places. But let's just say this has got a totally different elevation to the, um, to the Clayton we all know and love. But it's got French doors to the back there, into the garden. You've got another huge window at the front. And they've got a a sofa and two lovely chairs. Steve, from here, you can actually show the viewers the street scene because it is a really 
striking looking street. Some of the house types are absolutely stunning. Yeah. And obviously they are persimmon portfolio houses, aren't they? But they've they? just done a little but bit different. The on them, I just wish they do a lot super. more I wish they do a lot more like these yeah. developments really. It's, it's ultra modern the yeah. look of this. Rather than the, the houses they do now. Yeah, it's really lovely. The right, let's take a look upstairs. Okay then, first floor. So we're upstairs in the Clayton. Right, you're actually stood in bedroom three oh, there. Do I? So while we're there, well, let's take a look. Look right. at the beautiful melee brickwork on these. And you can see here Bishop's Cleave, you can see the hill there. Dimensions for bedroom three are two metres eight by two metres three. It's the polar bear room. Lovely. Back at the front then, so we're over the dining area. This is bedroom two. Dimensions, three metres 23 by two metres 56. It's a good sized double bedroom, isn't it? Yeah. Plenty of room there where you are for wardrobes or chests of drawers. Let me just look at the window. You have got a nice view from here. So this is this this development here is isolated only for similar builds in this side, and they're yeah. sort of trying to create a more almost like a village here, really. Yeah, because those houses over there yeah. are all for similar, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, so they're going to have a lot of more facilities you'd expect from a village. So tell the viewers a little bit about Bishop's Cleave and and what we know. Well, Bishop's Cleave is in Gloucestershire. Um, it is a, a lovely little sort of market town. It's really nice. It's. Um, or oldy baldy stone built properties etc you know yeah. um just you and uh, uh, predominantly there's a lot of new houses here there but, are a lot of other developments around but, here aren't but all of them are just a stone's throw from from the town centre which has yeah. got a tesco a Lidl. yeah lots of schools all your local amenities right so here you've got your bathroom now again they've got the finishing touches sign so just take note of, of what's an upgrade. Usually it's tiling, isn't it? Yeah. And showers and things. Nice towel rail, very different. Nice looking, nice. That is nice. Mmm. I like the tiling in here as well, yeah. do you? Yeah. Very, very nice. And the, uh, the spotlights too, the dining lighters, make a massive difference. Right. Oh. Creaky door. So this is your cupboard over the stairs. Well, there you go. We, what more would you need? Plan. Yeah, so it's so showing the overall um, development plan. There you can see over there on the orange. That the orange is a lot of the green spaces and stuff. So this site will eventually be shared with Persimmon and um, Charles Church. Yeah. Yeah. They're coming soon, anyway. Aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. So you've got a window here on the landing, so you can look at your back garden, and again you can look down the street. You can see the hills over there. And then bedroom one. So nice this room, I like it, it's a lot of windows. Yeah, it feels spacious, doesn't it? Let's have a look a little look down the street. Bedroom one is just a fraction over the four metres by three metres seventeen. Nicely dressed as well. So what have we got? Wardrobes, quite a deep wardrobe space as well. Bit of stuff in the cupboard there, never mind. And it's got an ensuite as well. So that's a double bed, I would say. But plenty of room around the bed. We've got a very nice shower. Same, we've got a rainfall shower in this one. Yeah. Um, and this is the only the big uh, ensuite, yeah. isn't it? So. I mean, for an ensuite, this that's the window, and it's at the front of the house, yeah. isn't it? So this is above the lounge, yeah. but a massive window. It's a big ensuite. It's yeah. the full width of the. Uh, of but the this is the only stand-up shower in the in the house. In the house, yeah. There isn't one in the bathroom, is yeah, there? No. But you could put one in if you wanted. Yeah. Very nice. it might snow later. Some serious wind about, isn't there? Mm. So, what do you think of the Clayton? 
Well, I thought we could maybe do it that way, Emma, because then people can see the houses outside there. Absolutely, and the black sky. Yeah, and I don't think <laughs> light's going to be an issue today. Yeah, um, they can't see me there. Okay. Right, there, there we go. you go. Well. Mm. As usual, I will put all of this detail in the description box down below, so check that out. There'll also be a link back uh, to Persimmon's website, so you can navigate back to them for prices this and availability. This is one of the best looking Persimmon sites um, I've been on. Yeah, I do have a price list here, so I'm sure they'd be very interested to tell you have what's available. Have you got a price available. on the Clayton there? Clayton. Well, I have, but there are two different prices, so it will be about variations, and oh, okay. I would encourage the viewers to get in touch with Persimmon directly. Well, I hope you've enjoyed the out. review. Now, as we review for you, we want you to review for us, so mm. go on our Facebook page, leave us a review, tell us why you like watching showrooms online. Yeah, and if you found it useful, tell us, yeah. and developers also like to know what you think of their houses. But we will catch you on our next video. Bye. Thanks for watching. Bye.